So this is yet another day when we're going to be going back in time to December 21st. Um, we were harvesting our first beef that weekend, so I wanted to show you that because stay tuned for tomorrow and you will get to see in current time what we have spent today doing, which is uh, cutting up the meat into pieces for grinding, for canning, also, you know, putting aside some steaks, some roast, etc., etc. So, enjoy the harvesting of our first beef as well as some Christmas preparations. I'll see you later. Today is D Day. We are going to be saying goodbye to one of our first two cows that we refer to as Hershey. We haven't had beef in a while and he's going to be providing some beef for our freezer. Why are you making it sound so depressing? It's not that bad. It's not a funeral. Uh, you're right. You're right. But I'm going to, I'm going to miss him. All right. The, the kids are telling me. But it's not that bad and I shouldn't be. <laughs> I'm wearing black. I've got my black coat on. Oh my gosh. All right, well, here's Hershey. Morning, Chase. Here's Hershey. I gotta get him before we... Let's see if I can get over here since I'm not wearing the best farm shoes. Morning, Hershey. Happy funeral. Yep. That's poor leg. I'm going to let the men do their thing and I'm going to go into town and get some ice after I grab my smoothie for breakfast. How's that orange, buddy? Matches your shirt. Ice. All right, pull it. All right. Now you hold this. Oh, what? Okay. I wasn't here. Let's just do it. Whoops. It's okay. All right. Oh, he's in trouble. All right, wait. No, don't push it again. I got to move it. Here, hold this. All right, now. Okay. All right, watch. Get me dumping it into this. <laughs> Go ahead. All right, let me just do it. Go ahead. We got 22 pounds of ice in two big coolers and my boys and we're gonna head head back home Me hungry. you're hungry Me hungry. okay I gotta call Nicholas back in addition to harvesting our first beef today it's December 21st and we have this annual tradition near us of the Lowry's parade so this is a, a fun Christmas parade that we do not every year but a lot of years
full of tractors and horses. and just not your typical Christmas parade. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. The tidings we bring to you and your kid. We wish you so people come camp up here. <laughs> waiting on it to start and now bring us some figgy pudding now bring us some figgy pudding now bring us some figgy pudding and bring my dad came and sat up here this morning with uh, well staked out a spot for us so we could tailgate Nicholas and Isaac are already up here with one of our cars and I brought everybody else Charlie's not quite done with the harvesting so he's going to be working on that and we're going to grill out and have a nice lunch and watch a great parade. The biggest downside to this parade is the candy. Wow, do they give out a lot of candy at this parade. I guess when they give out, they toss at you a lot of candy. And especially when they see a bunch of kids. So when you have 10 kids, or, well yeah, it'll be 10 kids for us today. We have Sarah with us. So, plus all my nieces and nephews. When you have all of them sitting on the sideline, guess what? We'll get way more than I could ever want. But, such is life. Hopefully we'll donate a lot of it. Deck the halls with boughs of holly Fa la 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 Tis the season to be jolly Fa la 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 Done we now our gay apparel Fa la 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 Hope you guys enjoy watching. Fast away the old year passes. Fa la 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 la. Hail the new year, lads and lasses. Fa la 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 la. Sing we joyous all together. Fa la 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 la.
We are back from the Lowry's Parade and I thought we would weigh all of the candy we got while I'm muzzling this little talker. <laughs> okay, so let's see. That has three pounds and eight ounces. All right, so Isaac has three pounds and Ten one ounces. ounce. Okay, so now we're up to, all right. Baby has four pounds, 11 ounces. Good job, me. 11 pounds and four ounces so far. Uh -huh. Okay, Anna Claire has three pounds and almost 10 ounces. So that's 14 pounds, 14 ounces. All right, Dominic's turn. Whoa, one push on it. Okay, Ooh, Dominic she here. Got more than Dave, than has Damien. Five pounds of candy. So now we're up to 1914. Amelia, put yours in. So Amelia has basically one rounded, well rounded up to two pounds. Dominic so wins! That was 19 pounds I just said, so now that we're up to 21 pounds. Are you keeping track for me, Sarah? Sure. <laughs> Alright, 21 pounds. Dominic wins! He has the most candy! Alright, well, I don't think we have, what about... Nope, that's all we got. Alex. Alex, Alex baby, baby, baby. Uh, 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 Aaliyah has her theirs. Oh, she didn't bring any home? No. Okay. So it's 21 pounds. I win! Dominic wins. Ah. So somebody I'm sure will correct my math because I was just trying to keep it all in my head, but 21 oh. pounds of candy is pretty darn close. Hey, you the should amount come of candy that we house. brought home this afternoon. What? I win! I, I win! I win! Comment on our posts. I win. Sure, comment on us and let us know if I if my math needs to be corrected. Or, or on it. Yes, kidding. you're the winner with five pounds I of I candy. candy. I got That's absurd. I win! <laughs> Did Nicholas bring any home? Did Nicholas bring any, bring any candy home? No, because he thinks he, we're just going to um, give him as much as he wants. Let's go home and well, and he's going to be correct because <laughs> y'all aren't keeping all that candy. What? Well, can you tell me about how it went with Hershey? Today, it went well with Hershey. With the exception that we were able to get the innards out. We struggled with that. It was very, very heavy. But other than that, we had a good time. It was went very well. It was very safe. It was quick. How many coolers full of meat do we have? Uh, five cooler fulls of meat, I believe it is. And we have it packed in ice for now. And so what are we going to do with that next? The next step is and continue to put it on ice and drain the water off every day. And then next Saturday we will uh, take the pieces out and start to okay. chop it up for ground beef. Okay. Are you looking forward to having more ground beef in the I house? Oh yes, I'm much ready for ground beef. It's been a couple years since we bought any ground beef, really. Yeah, definitely. We've bought a little bit from the store here and there, a little bit of um, <clears throat> breasted beef, but we're ready to have our own home-raised cow, and this is going to be a big blessing.